Hi, I'm Dr. Felisa Tibbetts, and I'd like to introduce you to the course on data collection and analysis for project monitoring and evaluation. If you are already involved in project monitoring and evaluation, then you will already have had some exposure to data collection methods. This course on data collection and analysis is an opportunity for you to brush up on some technical skills related to interviewing and surveys. You'll have the opportunity to learn about survey design and interviewing techniques, and we'll also get into practical areas for analysis, including thematic coding of narrative text and how to use Excel spreadsheets to carry out simple statistical operations. This four-week course is organized by particular topics for each week, and each week you'll get resources for you to review, and we'll have discussion forums in which I'll ask you to reflect and discuss important topics related to data collection. In our live webinars, we'll get into more details on the technical aspects of analysis. And you'll have the opportunity to work on a written assignment, which I hope will be useful for you in your work situation. Your options will be to develop a survey, an interview protocol, or to revise one you already have. Another option will be for you to develop a strategy for data collection, and that might be useful for those of you who already have data sets you're working with. This course complements AHREA's existing online course on project monitoring and evaluation. However, you don't need to have taken that course to enroll. You're welcome to register as long as you have um, already some familiarity with monitoring and evaluation and you want to concentrate on data collection and analysis. Just keep in mind this is not an advanced course and we're not going to get into sampling or regression analysis. A little bit about myself, I'm the co-founder and senior advisor at HREA. In addition to working at HREA, I've worked as an adjunct faculty member at places such as Harvard and Columbia Universities. I actually began my career as a full-time educational evaluator about 25 years ago, and I've carried out monitoring and evaluation projects since then with clients such as UNICEF, UNDP, Amnesty International, and the Ford Foundation. You can learn more about me, details about the course, and how to register on the course description page. Thanks very much for your interest, and I hope to see you in the course.